After the shock of his murder, the hunt for James Foley's killer is underway. The man in black who appears in the video spoke with a British accent. And on the line from Beirut, a journalist has told us that he has spoken to a former hostage who says he knows who that man is. He recognised this individual, both from his look and from his accent. Uh, he picked him as a, as a guy called John. Uh, obviously, that's not his real name, but that was the name that, uh, that he, was, he was given at the time. One of his jailers in a prison in Raqqa. He was the lead jailer of many foreign hostages there. Uh, there were three uh, British nationals in total. Uh, the, the former hostage that I spoke to uh, referred to these three British nationals as the Beatles. Meanwhile, security experts are examining the voice on the video to see if it matches anything they already might have on file. We would be looking for features of vowel and consonant sounds, rhythm, timing, pitch, intonation, voice quality, etc., all of which might help us to see how far the samples match in terms of these features. The US has confirmed it recently tried to rescue James Foley and other hostages, but the raid failed. It's known the Islamic militants are holding at least one other American, and it's believed they may have other Western hostages. This former director of intelligence and operations for MI6 says that would make it harder for Western governments. It is a point of leverage, and of course President Obama in the United States is coming under pressure now because there is another US uh, journalist held hostage by the same group. And so, yes, uh, that risk is always there. But I think wherever possible, the answer should be locate um, and rescue the hostages. And the Americans have continued bombing raids like this. The evidence, therefore, is the policy has not been affected by the murder. British forces are not in combat in the region. But some believe that could change. I would not be surprised if the current RAF mission in Iraq uh, was to extend, um, possibly to undertaking some bombing missions. Bringing his killer to justice will be difficult. Finding a solution to the conflict in which he died will be no easier. Andy Bell, 5 News.